Hey everybody, so last week's no code devs challenge was to create a scenario using Integromat and their COVID-19 app. So I decided to continue working with uh, Twitter and have it so when someone DMs the bot um, the name of their country, it will tell them the number of people recovered and a link to survival swag uh, from Etsy. So what I didn't realize was I had to accept requests from people. I'm pretty sure I opened the bot's DMs. So you can see a bunch of people tried to use the bot and it didn't work for them. Oops. <laughs> um, however, when I was testing it, you can see um, someone texts their country. It, the bot will tell them the number of people recovered plus a link to uh, a COVID related product on Etsy. And it just kind of picks a random one. Um, so this is what it looks like. So I have Twitter going to the COVID, uh, which goes to Etsy, which goes to Twitter. So this, the COVID app just takes the message data from the Twitter DM. And then on Etsy, I wanted to have it also select by the country code. So if you're in you know, Canada or Mexico, you won't get stuck with a product that has crazy shipping fees. But whenever I put in a country code, I got an error. So I just ignored that. <laughs> and then from Twitter, we have the Etsy URL, and then the country name and the number of people recovered. So this is a pretty simple one. Other people did really fancy looking ones. But I wanted to show you guys, I was getting a weird error. So they, so they deactivated my bot anyways because it was getting some weird error. But what I thought was strange was that the somehow it was getting my own messages uh, and as the country name instead of just the country name. So it was erroring out. So you can see, if you like look at the error details. And I wasn't really sure what to do about that. So you see bad, bad request, um, like at the number of people recovered, COVID, and the number, like this is all what the bot is supposed to tweet back. So it was somehow not just getting the um, getting the country name, it was trying to give all the information back based on the text that I had sent out. So that was a weird error I came across and I wasn't sure what to do about that. So you can see this request is happening within the COVID-19 app. So this is just supposed to be getting the country name. So I'm not sure what else to do since I have COVID just looking. Oh, maybe it's because I have it looking at the message data and I need it to look at something more specific. But why would it be looking at something that I already sent? It should just be looking at what the other person sent. So, anyways, um, yeah, that was this week's, or last week's challenge. I didn't place, obviously, and I see why, because it wasn't really working at all. But I gave it a shot, and um, it worked a little bit during my testing, so I got one step closer to creating a real Twitter DM bot.